Hey 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 guys, Mr Swift here and today we're going to do something a little bit different, it's a top 10, in fact a turbo top 10, that means it's going to be fast, you can see from the video length. Anyway, today's episode is going to be about games I feel should be remade or remastered or HD defied and uh, all this is my opinion, okay so please don't take it too seriously. System loaded. Ten. So coming in at number 10 is the original Rayman game on PlayStation 1. The soundtrack was amazing for this game, the level design, you can't fault it, it was just brilliant. The only reason it's not actually higher up on my list is because of Rayman Origins and Rayman Legends which kind of worked as a spiritual successor. Kind of like a HD remake in my opinion. Nine. So at number 9 we have Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Great gameplay, great plot, all I have to say is that ending though. Uh, wait a minute, didn't... Didn't someone buy the rights to all the Star Wars games? We could maybe see a remake. Oh. oh my no, God. God! No, God, please, no! 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 Eight. And at number eight, bending the rules here a bit, is Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare. The reason I say I'm bending the rules is because I don't actually want this, I'm just predicting it. Because if Activision can find a way to take money from your wallet, they will do it. Seven. At number 7 we have a cult classic in Time Splitters. Okay, awesome FPS gameplay is one of the best in the genre, in my opinion anyway. I mean, who would own the rights to a game like Time Splitters and not make a re- oh my god, not again. 6 so number 6 is Fire Red and Leaf Green 2.0 I guess. Basically the reason this is so low on the list is because of course these, this would be a remake of a remake, but it seems like Game Freak were kind of under some time constraints when they were making this, so it'd be cool to see their full idea of what they wanted, and also imagine if this looked like this. Five. At number 5 is Alien Noir, and I know what you're probably thinking to yourself, you're probably thinking Cameron, this didn't come out that long ago, the graphics are actually still pretty sweet on this, Rockstar know what they're doing. Yes I know, but the main selling point, or one of the main selling points to Alien Noir, was the whole facial indication of telling if someone was lying or not. Imagine that in super high definition graphics. Ugh. Four. Okay, number four, we have a bit of a weird one, but imagine this. Games like Tarzan, Toy Story 2, Buzz Lightyear, Star Command, Mickey Mania, Hercules, Aladdin, Lion King, Chip and Dale, Treasure Planet. All in one HD collection. Booyah. Disney, hitting us straight in the feels. Three. At number three, what do you get if you cross this? With this. You get Simpsons Hit and Run. This is nostalgia at its best, people. People loved this game back in the day. And the cool thing is, it would still be relevant today if it came out, okay? A second one would be probably the best thing, but a HD remake would not be far off and would be very well received by the fan base. Two. Taking the number two spot in my top 10 is Fallout 3. Okay, yes, I know Fallout 4 has been announced. Oh, by the way, talking about that. But just because the next instalment is right round the corner, doesn't mean I don't want to see the DC Wasteland in all its high definition awesomeness. One. And at number one is... Hello. Is it me you're looking for? So yeah, this one's a tie up between Crash Free and Spiral Free, and the reason I picked the third one in each instalment is because that seems to be where the developers kind of perfected the recipe. But it would be even better to have a HD collection of all of them, you know, I'll take what I can get. And if you do do a HD collection, add in CTR. Do it. DO IT! JUST DO IT! So that was the first ever episode of Turbo Top 10s, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comment section below so I can continue it. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, it means a lot to us. Hit the like button, go check us out on Facebook and Twitter for updates, and thanks for watching.